looks like we are here. Right here at Fairfield. Shaw. All right, so what we're gonna do now is I'm gonna pull in here and um, see where they want it. Sometimes they want us to put it at the dock. Sometimes right here to the right, we'll drop it. Those should be empties also, so I'm gonna try to get one of those empties there. Look, there's a new one back there. I'll try to get the best of the best trailer, you know what I'm saying? All right. And there's old Miller's transfer. What's up, bud? Is there anybody in there? Yeah. Where are you live? You live in, uh, you work for Millis? Yeah. You like them? Yeah, that's all right. I used to work for Heartland years ago. Uh -huh. I got a YouTube channel. Check me out sometime. Okay. You ever get tired of them, you need to come work for a company I work for, man. They're good. Okay, man. Dad of Dalton. Okay. Keep that in your back pocket. All right. All right, man. Go. All right. Let me go in here and see what they got going on here. Yeah, you ever go to their terminal in Georgia? You ever go to their terminal in Georgia, Millis? Yeah, I'm out of Georgia. Are you really? Yeah, that's how I live. We're out of Dalton, Georgia. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I've seen y'all. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's where we're out of. Yeah, I live. I live not far from there. Okay, yeah, I live in Decatur. Okay, Decatur, where it's greater. Yeah. Ah, man. Hey, appreciate it, man. <laughs> See you, bud. Yep. Yeah, I'm from. Uh, you know where um, Lithia Springs is? Uh huh. I'm from that area. So I'm from the west side, you're on the east side. Yes, sir. All right, boss. All right, man. All right, man. Howdy, howdy, howdy. Good. Good, good, good. Yeah, you can keep the whole bag and all. Where, where do you want it at? Door 17 is going to be. Awesome. I only got one there. There we go. Door 17. Door 17. Empties on the other side, I'm assuming. What's Cross that? empties over here, I'm assuming. Yeah, you can okay. take an empty in. 10 4. Thank you, sir. You have a blessed day, man. Hey, happy holidays. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. All right. So in and out of this place real quick. Like, just going to put it in 17 and then drop it. So I'll drop the trailer in 17 and then pick up my empty right on the other side. So this is what this trucking life's about. I appreciate y'all watching today's video. Hope it helped you out if you're interested in getting in trucking. You need to come over work for a good company. You can come over here at work Rosedale now. 706-226-1003. Just tell me your boy Sean sent you to get trucking. So break the seal like that. Open this bad boy up. Look like the load's still intact and everything's still good. And then I'm gonna take this right here and hook this to the side. That's the doors open. Still gotta watch those right there so they don't just fly open when you're whenever you're driving, because they and you'll you'll, you'll damage some stuff if you ain't careful. So I'll put that in there like that. That's good and locked. Some places make you slide the tandem, some don't. They didn't ask, so didn't say. So I'm just gonna go ahead and put it in door 17. Scan this paperwork in, hook it to my next trailer, and go with it. All right. All right, let's see here. So we are alive, so now I'm gonna go ahead and go on on duty. I should've went that a while ago, actually. So we'll do yard move on duty. Drop and hook, baby. Done, okay. Door 17. Ooh, he's a little tight right there. Look at that. He's doing good though. About over where I need to be. So I still got three hours, three and a half hours left on my drive, five on my total shift. So if I needed to take a break, I could. 
four and a 23 minutes for my eight hours so i ain't worried about that i'll just be stopped for the night but this right here is what i'll have to drive it's paused right now because i'm doing a yard move so i'm not driving but this still is counting down no matter what i do my 14 is going to be counting down this is your drive clock that you can't go over any of these hours this is my weekly i got 42 hours and 10 minutes left on the week this is my shift clock for the day it's my drive hours for the day and that's until my next break which really doesn't even matter because that's going to run out before then and that's about the same so all right door 17. so it's gonna be right on the other side of millis there looks like he's should be in the dock i think he made it in does he need to do a pull up yeah we'll let him do a little pull up real quick spot which is going to be right there next to that trailer so what i'm gonna do i'm gonna do them in there's a lot of ways you can do this i'm gonna do me a 90 in it you can do a 45 oh, you still doing a pull up oh my bad all right put flashers on little honk honk and here we go what i'm looking for is my back tire is going on that line right there see how the curve is going to be i'm trying to get them to curve right into that line but not too much at the same time i need to look over here and make sure ain't nothing in my way there everything's looking good see how it's going in there so i'm curving back to turning it back and making sure it's going to fall right now if i keep going this way it's not so i'm gonna give it a little more right now it looks like it's gonna go in so it's gotta learn to work it Sure, nothing over there is good. Kudoki. And if you have to do a pull up, it's okay. That's what it's about. Uh, looks like we're going in good. It's gonna be off a little bit. So I'm gonna have to do a little pull up here. Okay. So we'll go ahead and pull up to the right a little bit. looking good on that side get it over there a little bit there it in there we go looking good you're looking good today bam just like that it's just lined up right and there she blow neutral go ahead and let drop the load and i'll always come back and make sure everything's lined up these little racks in the ground is a good way to make sure you line it up correctly it's for these dock plates but take your dock plate like this some of them just have these kind but these are here pull out and we'll stick it right in the middle here ow there we go got my finger all right, then we're gonna come down here. I'm gonna level this landing gear. Pretty quick thing. Drop these things pretty quick. About that much above the ground. Go ahead and pull our cable. Not like I call that a cable, but you know what it is. Do these. No matter how far you go, you still want to hook these things up because even though I'm just going right over there, you don't want this to drag the ground cause you any issues. You know what I'm saying? All right. Okay. 
then we're gonna go ahead and lower our ab bags. Release. Pull off real easy. Easy, easy do it. And once it's done, go ahead and raise your airbags back up. You good to go. Now they found an empty trailer. There's a 24 series down here, I believe is empty. It's a new trailer, so should be empty. On this side should be the empties. It's like Miller's transfers going right there next to that one, but it's all good. Let him do his thing. So we're gonna go ahead and just go on in front of him, then back up right to that one. All right, when you're Bob telling you backing up, let's see. You don't want to back all the way up under it. You want to stop right there, get out, take a look. And one thing I need to get fuel here in a minute. What we want to do is make sure that fifth wheel is going up under that, which it is. So we're good to go there. Uh, I'm also come back here and make sure this thing's empty. I don't want to hook it all up and then it not be empty. It wouldn't be no fun, would it? here hello yep she's empty then i'll hook it all up do my pre-trip and hit the road jack don't you come back no more no more no more no more hey appreciate you watching today's video if you got any value from it hit that thumbs up button hit that like button turn it live with sean baby let's get it